Hello everybody, welcome to Plain Simple. Today we'll be looking at how these modern jets protect their leading edges and the wings overall from getting ice buildup on the leading edges, or on the wings overall. We're gonna look at, we're gonna start back in the engines. Let's walk over to the engines, go take a look over there. Alright, we are back in the engine. We're looking at the bottom side of the right engine, number two engine, on this aircraft. And we're looking, this is the front of the engine, the intake is here, air goes in, gets compressed, mixed with fuel, heated up, combusted, and exhausted out the back. Now, these here, these two ducts, are special ducts. These are called bleed air ducts. They bleed air from the compressor, two different stages of the compressor, and they duct the air away from the compressor into the aircraft for different functions. One of them, well, there's air conditioning, and one of the functions is heating up the leading edges. So starting from here, the hot air from the compressor, because when you compress the air it heats up, and this air gets compressed so high that the air leaving here is pretty toasty, it goes down these ducts, through the pylons, into the fuselage, which I'll show you these ducts here, I mean from the air compressors and the engines leaving through the fuselage, the engine is up here compressing the air, feeding it through the pylons, through the fuselage and then it comes out of these ducts right here and it is piped through underneath the belly of the aircraft now we're looking forward at the aircraft this is right main landing gear left main landing gear, this is the belly of the aircraft and that hot air from the engines is piped underneath the belly of the aircraft we'll follow that there's the pipes we'll keep following that here's the wheel well for the landing gear there's those pipes, right engine, number two engine, number one engine and they come this way and we're just now we came from the back of the airplane underneath the wing box which is here right underneath all that from the engines and here it splits into the left wing and right wing and in here it gets fed into the leading edge into this fixed portion of the leading edge to heat up this portion right here that does not move this is fixed on the wing and on the slats which are movable they extend in and out and you would have seen that on one of my previous videos to feed that same hot air that heats up this fixed portion of the leading edge to feed that hot air in here there's a special pipe Is a telescoping pipe right here. This section is telescoping and it retracts and it follows along with the slat and it feeds that same hot air heating up the rest of the leading edge that fits into a tube in here which is called a piccolo tube. Piccolo tube just like the instrument, the piccolo. It's a flute. It's a long tube that follows the rest of the leading edge and it's full of little holes and it heats up the rest of that leading edge and that air is fed through that telescoping pipe right here which is the same hot air coming from the engine's compressors that heats up the fixed area of the fixed leading edge over here and the point of heating up, feeding that hot air from the inside to heat up this leading edge of the wing is to prevent ice from building up at altitude. 
when you fly through cold uh, up at altitude and it gets very very cold any moisture in the air in the atmosphere will stick to the wing build up ice and change the shape of the airfoil this hot air heats up the leading edge and prevents that from happening keeping the plane safely flying up in the air um, I hope that made sense and uh, see you next time bye